jazzy kind of way in a in a poetic metaphorical kind of way it can also mean right the heart mm. right so allah is going to what was going to expand their right live dhikra what is the dhikra it is remembrance well dhikra isn't no dhikr dhikr is remembrance right so we have the word dhikr and then we have dhikra right especially when you see this ad dhikra it's just a synonym for the Quran. Quran, oh yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So Allah is going to expand their chests. Whose chests? The chests of the, the hearts of the mu'minin. How is he going to expand it? Lil Quran, yani al-dhikra. Lil dhikra. So as we can see, these terms will be used in other places. So uh, if you want to read for us this first line, Sister Ruqayya, and you will probably recognize it. Right. M many of us will know this from Surah Al-Layl, right? And as for the one that is obedient and fears Allah, and is honest in doing good, fasanu we will. As a result of the person of the mu'min doing that, we will yassara, right? Same, right? Ya sin ra with that shadda. That's the same thing that he was talking about up here. Wa yassara al mu'minina lil yusra. That's why Ibn Abi Zayd, he's essentially borrowing and paraphrasing from the Qur'an. Allah says, فَسُنُوا يَسِّرُهُ لِلْيُسْرَى What does this mean, فَسَنُوا يَسِّرُهُ? فَا Do we understand? فَا is a complicated letter. It can mean many, many things. But you can basically say it means as a result of which. As a result of what? The one man aata wa taqa wa taqa Allah wa sadaqa, right? The one that tells the truth and is honest and such and such, as a result of that, for their reward. Sa, what's the sa here? Future, he will. Exactly, future tense. Nu, we. Nu yasiru, we will. We will do what? We will make it very easy for him. What's Yusra? Yusra. Right? If Yasara means to do good, right? It's all part of the same root of made easy. easy. But it's like Al Yusra. What's Al Yusra? What's, what's the most easiest thing that we can think of? The thing that will bring the most ease, the most relaxation, the most calm. What is the ultimate place? Jannah. Yes. Jannah. We will make it very easy for that person to go to Jannah, the one that what? Obeys and fears and is honest in doing good. Fasunu yassiruhu lil yusra. Okay, Abdul Wakil, let's do this line. Fa'amanu. Fa 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 right? Yes. Bi'al sinatihim. Right, right here. فَآمَنُوا بِاللَّهِ بِأَلْسِنَتِهِمْ نَاتِكِينَ وَبِقُلُوبِهِمْ مُخْلِصِينَ Right, now what is this word مُخْلِصِينَ? The word... Tell me about this word مُخْلِصِينَ. What, what is it? Oh, it 
It comes from the root word kalasa, uh, which is iklas. Right. Sincere, sincere. So one, if we just take off the ina, we have what? Mukhlis. Yes. Right? So it's the plural of mukhlis. Mukhlisina is the plural of mukhlis. Right? That's that, you know, so we have mukhlis. And then we have mukhli suna and mukhli sina, depending on it. And as you said, what? It comes from the verb actually akhlasa. Right? Akhlasa, it then goes to mukhlis. Right? Akhlasa is a form for verb. It is also, as we said, this form, the form of af, a, la, right? This is the transformative, right? This is the transformative uh, 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 form, right? So, for instance, what's another transformative form for verb that we know very, very well, hopefully? Islam? Not Islam is a, is a noun. Oh. But Aslama, <laughs> right? Aslama is to become Muslim. And therefore, the noun, as you said, is Islam. And the one that does Islam is the Muslim. Muslim. Right? Muslim. We can continue this by, we have what? Akhlasa. We have <clears throat> ikhlas and mukhlis. Aslama, Islam, Muslim. Akhlasa, ikhlas, mukhlis. What if I gave you, we'll do it in reverse order. I bet you you guys know this word. What's this word? Muhsin. Muhsin. So let's go in reverse order. If we go from Muslim to Islam to Aslama, how do we go in reverse order from Muhsin? Ihsan. Exactly. Ihsan. And what's the verb? Hasana. Mm -mm. Look at the look at the pattern. Aslama, akhlasa. Right? Muhsin, Ihsan, Ahsana. Let's do another reverse order. Hopefully, you guys know this word. What is this word? Mu'min. Mu'min. So, what do we have from Mu'min? And what is our verb going to be? Except we can't have a'amana. We're going to have a'amana. 
Amana. Mu'min Iman Amana. Muhsan Ihsan Ahsana. Mukhlas Ikhlas Akhlasa. Muslim Islam Aslama. Can keep going and going and going with many examples. Can you see the pattern here? Right? The pattern is what? Af'ala. Right? The pattern, let me get rid of this part, right? So we have Af'ala. If. Al. An. Muf. Il. Right? Only difference I haven't put in. So if. Al and Muf Muf in. Right, that's the pattern. So you apply that to anything that is going to have that uh, have that pattern. Make sense? Yes, no? Yes, yes. Info overload? <laughs> no. Okay, alhamdulillah. Right here. Okay, man. Atat. Atat. 